So hello guys, and today, the OCE hashtag free Fortnite Cup has just ended, and I feel like I had a decent Apple loop path, so I want to share it with you guys. So let's get right into it. So, to cover my games, altogether I got 301 apples, and the most apples I got in a game was 62. To go over each game, the first game I got 35, second game I got 30, the third game I got 62, the fourth game I got 19, the fifth game I got 6, the sixth, sixth game I got 0, the seventh game I got 37, the eighth game I got 17, the ninth game I got 0, the tenth game I got 34, the eleventh game I got 0, and the last game I got 61. So I would land at Honely Hills, which actually has three apple spawns near it. So I would land at the house the furthest away, land where exactly where the chest is, start mining, get a bit of mats. You don't loot the whole building, just loot the top layer of the building. Now get on top of the roof, build two ramps. In this game I accidentally build one, but I would build two ramps, jump off off the ledge, and into the apples. Now once you've got these apples, go down the hill right here so you don't get seen by the house next to this place, and then rotate down, rotate down over here. Now this is another apple spawn. Both of these spawns can actually give three to seven apples, so if you're lucky hopefully you get seven, but yeah that happened to me I think three times, so not that uh, frequent. So once you've got those apples, come over here across all the way over here to these trees over here now again this tree is going to have three to seven apple spawns so yeah just from these locations which takes about one to two minutes to loot you're going to get around at the least nine apples and at the most 21 apples so after we loot these apples we're going to go down the cell and get this chest now when you're looting make sure to get heals since we're going to be taking a lot of storm damage okay and also try to get some rotation items. So in these games I usually carry advantages, me kits, um, potentially crash pads, and a lot of peppers. Now once we get down here, grab this bow down here and drive all the way to the yacht. Now go to this left side of the yacht with this, um, I guess, crate, and there is one norm spawn there. Um, at this ship we're just going to try to get all the norm spawns here, so follow my left path right here. There's two here, um, we go up a layer here, I actually mucked this up, this is one of my first games, so I actually didn't fully know the loop path, so I go up here, there's another two right here, um, you see I'm grabbing all these peppers, because I need it for rotation, and the last one is up here. Now, once we've loaded every nom, I didn't get any apples this time, take the whirlpool. Now, since I have peppers, I decided to go craggy cliffs, but if you have no rotation and zone is really far, take the second option I'm about to show you. But this game I had peppers so I was like okay who cares I'm gonna loot through Craggy since I might get some um, apples. So yeah those are the two norm spawns at uh, Craggy Cliffs. I continue on rotating. I'm actually gonna show you what happens if you actually go past Craggy Cliffs and the rotation for that scenario. So right here I've got no rotation, zone's really far so I don't go to Craggy Cliffs. Instead, I go to this uh, gas station right here, which has one norm spawn. So once I hit this uh, gas station, I go over to Orchard. Now the thing about Orchard is, every single game, I at least got 15 extra apples from Orchard, since nobody knows how to la loot Orchard. Now, this is just for OCE, for EU, NA East. People might know how to loot Orchard, but for this, OCE region, no one knew how to loot Orchard, okay? I played uh, 12 games, 9 games I was alive and went to Orchard, but 9 out of 9 games, there was at least 15 apples at Orchard, so yeah. So the thing about Orchard is that, yes, there are tons of apples on the floor, but when you break the trees, it actually also gives you apples. Now this is every single tree inside this fenced area. So there are obvious, there's obviously a fenced area on the right side and on the left side. So that is two fenced areas with about, I don't know, like 60 trees. And they all have a chance, like a really, really good chance of giving apples. So when you're knocking down these trees and getting those apples, make sure to use the heals that you should have um, stockpiled. But if you don't have any heals, maybe you've run out or something, there is a campfire to the left. So you can just sit on the campfire, stoke it, and shoot the 
uh, trees using a gun since that also works and causes apples to fall from the tree. Now once you've fully looted uh, the orchard, so you've chopped down every single tree inside of the orchard, the, pe the uh, fenced area, then you go inside. Then go straight forward and left, past the freezer. There should be two nom spawns there, so get those, then go outside the building. Once you go outside the building, there is one apple and one nom spawn right here. But, if you're still alive at this point, like I was in this game, you can actually go to the Frenzy Farm barn, then the house, since there are both noms there, and even if you're still alive to this point, you can even go to authority like I did in this game. Now, this only happened to me once, so I don't think this should happen to you guys too often, but this is possible. Well, thank you guys for watching to this point of this video. Even though I probably won't win any of the gaming hardware, I hope you guys do with this loot path if you are going to use it. And peace.